the 1889S Morgan Dollar. A forger added an S mint mark to a Philadelphia mint coin in an effort to create a more valuable specimen. The vast difference between Morgan mintages at the San Francisco and Philadelphia facilities in 1889 has resulted in a great disparity in price. This entices nefarious individuals who might be tempted to add an S to an 1889 Philadelphia specimen to make it look like a rarer, more valuable San Francisco issue. At first glance, the 1889 S shown above seems legitimate. Even under magnification, the S mint mark evidenced no obvious problems, and its size and style appear to be correct for an 1889 S. No seam was visible around the letter, and no residue or discoloration was apparent, both of which would suggest the mint mark was glued to the surface. The S appears to be integral, not a later addition. When authenticating any coins, collectors should keep in mind that every specimen has three sides. In the case of this 1889 Morgan dollar, the edge exposes the nature of the mint mark alteration. Inspection of the mint mark reveals an area of discoloration along the edge of the coin directly below the S. This reading on the edge also has been tooled in the same area as evidenced by the irregular shape of the reeds. The counterfeiter had to tool the edge to cover his tracks. In this type of alteration, a hole is carefully drilled into the edge of the coin. A special tool bearing the correct size and style of the S is then inserted in the hole and with a squeeze of the device, the mint mark is pushed up or embossed from the inside, yielding an S on the surface of the coin. This method is usually employed on coins with wide rims and mint marks close to the edge, such as buffalo nickels. It is unusual to find such an alteration on a Morgan dollar. When evaluating a key date coin, it is important to look not only at its obverse and reverse, but also at its edge. This is especially necessary for coins with mint marks near the rim.